Aloha, Jackie here. Thanks for joining me today in creating a card using Stampin' Up! Sweet Gingerbread stamp set and the Gingerbread House dies. I didn't take them out because they're going to be using quite a few pieces. Made this card in our workshop the other day um, and I wanted to share it with you folks. Um, this here crumb cake cardstock will be our base. Uh, this is cut at four and a quarter by 11, scored at five and a half. And since it is a long piece, let me go ahead and burnish that fold or that score line. Another piece of crumb cake cut two and a quarter by two and three fourths. And this is for cutting out our house. This is the inside layer. This is a basic white cut at four by five and a quarter. This here for our mound or our hilltop, this here is cut by four by two inches, and this is scrap for stamping and die cutting. And then this, our designer series paper, is cut four by five and a quarter. Okay, let's um, go ahead and start stamping so that we can go ahead and die cut because I think that takes a while and I should have, you know, die cut prior to, but I did not. Um, okay, let's do real red. Real red is our door. Okay. And we'll need that later, but we do not need it right now. Coastal Cabana. Coastal Cabana will be our windows. And then, uh, let's see what else I needed. Crumb cake. Crumb cake will be our trees. And I'll need three trees. Three trees. And then I will be using Bermuda Bay for the lollipops. Just like that. Um, and then I think, yes, I do have enough space. Let's get the mini stamp and cut emboss machine out. Make room, make room. And plates one and two. And then where's my dies? Get my dies out here dies. I'll need this at the top here. See if any of my lady friends from Card Workshop is watching. They remember how this was done. And then I was wondering how come inside my fingers uh, and my fingernail it's sore. But it's probably because I dug the... Um, I'm getting some washi tape. I probably because I dug the um, this dies into it. I was wondering how could it be sore? Why is it sore? Right now it just dug into it and it, it's the same sore, so or same pain. Okay, roll that through. Probably could have put more dies on there. We'll put more dies next round. Oh, sheesh. Okay. We're done with this. I was thinking, I don't even know where I took it from. We took it from here. It fits. Yeah, I should draw the, the, I should draw the outline so I know where to put them after I'm done. Yeah, we did that in one of our videos where I shared that with you guys. 
No, it's a little off this one, even though I had the... Okay. Even though I had the washi tape on it. I didn't center it good enough. Well, it is good enough, huh, you guys? It is. It's homemade. There. And we can put on... Um, oh, did the tree come from there? Let me grab more washi tape, you guys. This is just an old roll of washi tape. I don't even know where I got it from. Move this up a little so I can fit this one over here. Yeah. There you go. Grab more washi for the window and the door. Oh, am I out of view? Sorry, guys. I'm just putting the windows and the door. One more piece of washi for the last window piece. It's the only thing, this one's here, the dies are so small that I wanted to put the washies to keep them in place. Try that. Oh, you're on true. I'm not done yet, you know. Got that. Put this in here. I don't know if that's where I got it. Put it in there. Oh, I probably got the window from over there. The window. Oh, and you know what? I might have to grab another scrap. I thought I had leave myself enough space. But okay, here is maybe this guy fits there. It's the only thing, yeah, putting them back. Like, where'd it go? That's good, that's good though. You all fit. Do you guys run into that? That one fit there. This one fit here, huh? Well, let's move this one over here like that. Much better, better. Um, I needed a roof. Does the roof fit here? Let me see. It does, I think. Hmm? Yeah, I forgot I needed the roof like this and didn't leave enough space, I guess, yeah. Okay, run them through really quickly. house do I tape him down too I think it would have been fine without tape yep yeah. okay and oh yeah 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 oh my gosh yeah he would have been fine without tape you guys Okay, uh, let's put the, oh, where the house was. Let's put the house back. And then grab this white two by, what did I say, two by four? And grab the mound or this hill kind of slurrat. 
put them on. Roll them through. You don't even need it that thick. You don't want. Yeah. This is just a mound, see? And I think we have all our pieces, guys. Let's get this out of the way. And this too. Because, yeah, I think we're all good now. Get rid of the little washy washies. Okay. And then, um, oh, okay, we can stamp this to this. Um, Bermuda Bay. I want a Bermuda Bay stamp. Um, here, I'm going to stamp from our home to yours. And then have a sweet Christmas. And then with um, the pink pad, polish pink. Oh, let me clean this because I think I used. Yeah, I used a Bermuda Bay. I want to do pink just like that to tie it into the front okay we're good on our um, ink pads you guys so we can put that out of the way open up our card base and put our inside layer in Go ahead and put this one on too, I think. It'll be fine. Center, best as you can, right on the top. And then this one here, put them down too. It's only on the pink. I like use liquid glue, wiggle room time. Move it just a tiny bit just to cover the DSP underneath. Good job. There you go. Yeah. And then this here, I guess we weren't done with the stamping, you guys. Sorry about that. I needed to stamp the outline of the door. And the window just right on the front just like that and then also the house decorations in the front just like that in red um, and then we can go ahead and put this one down straight and then what I wanted to do what put the house I mean the house a tree over here and then a lollipop here or even in front of the tree lollipop here tree here and then popped up tree over here too yeah and then the door right in the front with the window so tiny I should be using my take your pick tool with this you could do that and then here let's go ahead and put our, our tree down
this tree too straight down. And this here I'm going to put dimensionals. Dimensionals. Um, I'm using up my old ones. Let's see. Let's just get a new one for that. Like that. On top there. This one here, we can use the old ones. I mean, not old ones, but you know, the edges. Use them up, use them up. Oi. I need a piece over here too. Let me get my paper snips. Yeah, right here. Tiny, tiny piece, you guys. Right here. Popped up. Then I have this over here. Popped up. This one over here. Popped up. Oh, I thought I, um, this, um, cloud, is it a cloud or is this smoke from the chimney? Just let out. And then this here, you guys, what I was going to do was take, let me use the backing of this, um, I t oh, that's what fell down over here take my snowfall accents puff paint stampin up sells this you can get this in my online store one five zero six nine one shake well shake well and um, then you can tell we were using it it's all in there all over hold the, I hold the tip over here and then just put oh, some puff paint on top of the roof. Mm -hmm. And then uh, grab my heat tool uh, on level two. Wait till it comes warm. Oh, my purpose they're bending over there, the backing. Maybe it wasn't a good idea to use that. But as you can see, the puff paint, when you heat it up, it gets puffy. So it's puffing up over there on top of the roof line. Don't burn yourself. Don't touch this. I just touched it. Burn myself, man. Yeesh. Okay. Then I'm going to put some puff paint over here. And the, oh, that was a lot. That too. Okay, and then I'll go ahead and turn this on again.
Nope, am I banging everything? <laughs> Okay, and then uh, this is quite warm right now, but it when when it cools off, it will, um, the card will go back down flat. But it curled a little. But can you see? I had put plenty over here, so this one here is really puffy. But can you see the puffiness? Let me get the roof line so we can go ahead and glue it down. Do you see the roof line? Can you see the puffy? It's pretty cool, pretty cool, you guys. So let me get the glue. Glue it down. It's pretty warm. I'm gonna hold it in place just for a little bit. This doesn't come as hot as the metal. Maybe use the bone folder instead. But there you have it, guys. What do you think? And it did curl a little. Maybe I should have just done it, done it flat like this. But it does curl a little, and like I said, it'll come out flat. I did make another one earlier, and it is quite flat right now. Um, let me get rhinestones. I see that I put some rhinestones on there. How could we have forgotten? Let's go ahead and get some rhinestones and put some rhinestones on there. And there you have it, guys. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks again for joining me today to order Stampin' Up! products. Please visit my online store. The website is linked in the description of this video. Don't forget to like this video by giving it a thumbs up and subscribing. Come back again soon. Bye!